hi developers so now we will learn that how we can install xamp in our system so you may have question that why you need to install xamp when we are learning laravel see we can directly install php and mysql also but uh, that will be a lengthy process first of all we have to uh, download the php then we have to install it and then we have to set the environment and same thing we have to do with the mysql also easy solution is that we can directly download the xamp and install it it will automatically provide the uh, php and mysql right and uh, whenever we are working with the laravel we must have to install php and mysql even we can use any other database also like uh, mongodb or mysql server or oracle but uh, mysql and php is a good combination so most of the time we use mysql as a database with the laravel or with the php so that's why we can directly install the xamp so how we can install it and then i will tell you that uh, how we can check that php and uh, mysql and xamp is installed properly or not so let's just open a new tab and simply put here download xamp and let's click on the first website which is apachefriends.org and here you will find the different kind of version like 7.4.28 8.0.17 or 8.1.4 so you should always go with the latest version even when we are working with the laravel 9 then we need at least php 8 so last two versions will uh, definitely work but let's go with the latest version with which is 8.1.4 so when we will click on the download it will start downloading our file so i am just cancelling it because i already downloaded that setup i can show you in the uh, here download folder so we will use that setup and we will save our internet as well as our time so let me click on the double click on that setup and uh, after that it will start executing it will ask some basic steps like folder and agreement and just next 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 some steps after that our uh, setup will be downloaded this is very easy and uh, i guess most of the developer know that how we can install uh, xamp in our system because uh, i'm sh very sure that you already know about uh, basic things about php and when you learn that things you uh, work with the uh, xamp or if you are using uh, ubuntu or linux system then there is a chances that you used lamp but the behavior of both xamp and lamp are mostly similar so even you can use the default folder also like uh, in the c directory we can simply use xamp but uh, i already installed the xamp that's why i'm just changing that folder so let me put here xamp uh, 2 or something right and uh, if xamp is not installed in your system then you can directly go with the xamp folder you can put any name to that folder it will not uh, make any difference and let me click uh, uh, one more time and now it will prepare to install it will unpack file and after that we are ready to go with the xamp so let me pause the video and i will just resume it again once our setup is uh, installed so that we can save the time so at last so let's allow that access and uh, and zap is actually installed so now we can finish it and after that let's uh, you can see that our setup is here so if you want you can start apache with that your php will be started and if you want to start the mysql database then you can also click on the start and there is some option for uh, a configuration also but let it be we will just check them later because for a moment we want to check that uh, php mysql is installed or not and now let's uh, simply open the command line here you can check that php minus p if uh, you will find that there is a version uh, like php 8.4 point uh, 8.1.4 or some uh, other version that means php is installed your system and you can same check with the mysql also and uh, if not installed then um, uh, and your system is older then you can just try uh, after restart your si uh, system then it might work and if you still have any kind of, any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box and thank you so much for watching this video